Are you actually filming? Okay. Can't see the pits, can you? Nope. You're not filming, are you? Well, they didn't get a teeth. Ah, God dang it. Teeth in you threw me off. Hey guys, CJ here from NSS with this week's tip of the week. Today I want to talk about a holiday related topic that I've had uh, good conversations with a lot of folks over the last couple weeks. And it's the idea that the holidays really come down to three or four specific events in terms of meals. You know, you think of the holidays maybe four to six weeks in duration. It's a time where we get into a little bit of that mindset of, uh, it's the holidays, kind of say screw it to our diets or whatever we're doing with our routine and say, we'll get back to it January type of thing. Um, but really, if you think of it, there's, there's Thanksgiving, there's Christmas, there's a few holiday parties here and there, but it's not like every night there isn't something. So really, sticking to your normal routine is easy to do 80 to 90% of the time and something that's good to remind yourself of too. So know that you know those, those certain events, you might go out of your norm. For example, you might have an extra dessert or two, you might have some more drinks that you're not used to. But generally speaking, the majority of that time during the holidays, you can stick to your normal routine in terms of nutrition, you can stick to your normal workouts for the most part outside of those, those small outlier dates. Um, so keep that in mind as you go about these next few weeks and, and try to stick to your routine as best you can. That way when you get to January, you're not starting from square one or you're not feeling like, oh man, I'm so out of shape. But you're just kind of, oh, it's January. Like I had a good holiday season, had fun with family and friends, um, but I'm still in great shape. I still feel really good and I still feel like I'm in a good routine that I can continue on for the next year round. So take that for what's worth. Give us any feedback, any comments if you have it, and uh, we'd love to hear from you. Thanks, guys. We'll talk to you later.